afternoon, a Miami-Dade County commissioner who championed safer roadways is now charged with DUI. Key West police say he was riding his motorcycle drunk and was speeding. CBS 4's Natalia Zaya is live outside the commissioner's home in West Miami-Dade. Natalia, no sign of him since his arrest? No sign of him at this point. We have seen his wife and his daughters coming in and out, but so far Pepe Diaz has kept a low profile since his arrest. Police say that he failed police uh, field sobriety tests and also refused a breathalyzer and refused to give a blood or urine sample. He's now charged with driving drunk. According to police, Miami-Dade County Commissioner Jose Pepe Diaz was so drunk when cops pulled him over, he had to sit on a seawall because he was unsteady on his feet. Diaz, they say, was speeding more than 70 miles an hour in a 30-mile-an-hour zone in Key West. Possibly taking part in a charity motorcycle ride over the weekend. When police stopped him on his Harley, they say Diaz got off the bike without putting out the kickstand, causing it to topple over. According to the police report, Diaz told the officer he had consumed a rum and coke and one glass of champagne approximately three hours prior to the traffic stop. Diaz also told them he was a commissioner for Miami-Dade County. The report describes visible signs of Diaz impairment, reading, During the time I spoke with Diaz, I noticed him to have a slight slur, his eyes to be bloodshot, watery, and glassy, his eyelids to be droopy, and a moderate to strong odor of an alcoholic beverage coming from his breath and person. He consented to several field sobriety tests, which he failed, including walking the line. When Diaz began the exercise, he missed numerous steps heel to toe, stepped off the line, and used his arms for balance, according to the officer. Diaz has not yet spoken publicly about the arrest, releasing only a statement that reads, Under advice of my legal counsel, I cannot discuss details at this time. However, I look forward to resolving this matter. In the meantime, I will continue to serve my community and the residents of District 12 as I have done for the last 24 years, and I humbly ask for your patience during this time. His colleagues are distancing themselves from the arrest. That's an issue for uh, the commissioner, and uh, you know I wish him all the best. But at least one of his neighbors has an opinion on it. I'm a little bit disappointed. He, he should know better. Diaz has served as a commissioner here in West Miami-Dade for the past 13 years. He's even pushed for a bill that made the streets safer for cyclists. His court hearing will be in Key West on October 5th. And we understand from the police department that the entire exchange was caught on an officer's body camera, as well as some footage caught in the patrol car's dash cam. We expect to have a look at some of that footage later today. Natalia Zaya, CBS 4 News. Natalia, thank you. Police have located